This is a Now It Can Be Told story. 4.25 in the Mediterranean on the afternoon of November the 25th, 1941. A salvo of torpedoes fired at close range struck HMS Barham. The stricken battleship heeled over to port. Within four minutes of being hit, her after magazine blew up. She sank with a loss of 859 lives. At what stage in the convoy did the tragedy of the barroom happen? Uh, it was the following day. Uh, I used to sit up on the upper deck most of the time when I was at sea, and I usually went as high as I could uh, for two reasons, one for protection and one for uh, you could see more. So I used to sit up on the Admiral's Bridge in the battleship, and I was sitting up there all day long. Uh, you had to be around, as you'd appreciate, you know, uh, if, uh, the incidents at sea always happened so quickly yeah. that if you weren't there, you didn't get them. Uh, but about half past four-ish, I was a bit thirsty, so I thought I'd go down for a cup of tea. And I'd just got off the bridge, and about two flights down, uh, ladders, and um, I heard a, a terrific bang. I looked around, the ship went hard to port, and uh, I could just see the bar on ahead of us. We were steaming in line ahead. How far away was she, roughly? Quite close, actually. Uh, a few cables, I think they call them. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, it's quite close. And uh, we, st we had to turn very sharply to avoid hitting her, because she's just stopped dead. And I just saw, at that particular moment, uh, the spouts which the torpedoes throw up when they hit anything. I'd seen them before in other operations, so I knew what had happened. But, How many uh, were there? There were four, in fact. It hit her in the engine room. And um, she uh, listed rather badly straight away, as you saw in the film just now. And uh, so I oh, well, sort of rushed up as fast as I could uh, back to my camera and started to film. I took a shot and I thought, well, I wonder what she's going to do. You know, uh, we used to use cameras at that time, which were only ran 200 feet, which is about two minutes. Yeah. Uh, so we had to use a sort of camera at sea because they were clockwork and uh, we didn't have to worry about batteries and things, that sort of thing. So uh, I, I thought, well, shall I change the film or not? And I thought, well, I think I'd better take another shot. She was listing rather badly. And I started to film and I saw she started to turn over. And I got a bit worried about my film, and I thought, again, I think I'd better change the film, because she'd probably turn turtle. And as I was sort of trying to make up my mind what to do, uh, it blew up, as, as you saw. A terrifying explosion. Yeah, yeah, terrifying. Uh, so in an occasion like that, uh, one's mind sort of goes pretty well blank anyway, and all one's thinking of is the picture, actually, which one shouldn't do, of course, but... Uh, and uh, it was only afterwards one realised what really had happened. Do you rate that? Do you almost vivid experience as a cameraman? Uh, war experience, yes. Mm -hmm. 